So God came to me last night in my sleep. I know. And the first thing I realized is that he's not quite as white as y'all may think. But I'm pretty sure he was reading my mind because then he smoothed out his clothes a little and placed his hand on his hip for just a bit. And the second thing I realized is that I was talking to God before the sturdy blueberry chicken wire posts of heaven. And I'm pretty sure he was reading my mind because then he spoke soft but with purpose. To which he said, hello, Faith. To which I, of course, said, hi, God. <laughs> and I'm wondering why he'd visit me out of all of his beautiful creation's dreams. I am trembling. I need to tell you something. Are you listening close? He smiled. Yeah. <laughs> you are only as good as the greatest love poem you have ever written. And he looks at me, a little sly and smitten, and then earnestly and honestly, and before I can barely mutter, you mean like, for boy? He's gone, and I'm straining at the little green digits of my alarm clock at 3 a.m. What the heaven? So I roll my cold, resting body over, turn on the lamp, and rummage for the little black journal and bright, <laughs> and bright red poem folder. Love poems, love poems. Oh, here we are. I clear my throat, and in my mind it sounds pronounced loud and defined so early in the dark. I have written you 1,000 love poems every day. One, the fold your smile creates on the outskirts of your face. So soft, so soft. A bunch of black scribbly marks. No, keep looking, keep looking. Only as good next page. It may be true that the only race you consistently win is the one from my head to my heart and back again. No, flip, flip, quote, flip. Drawing of a glass of lemonade. Flip, number of a family I babysit for. Flip, flip. Roses are red, violets are blue. I like your face, we should make out. Probably not what God was talking about. Flip, 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 I'm flipping, I'm flipping out, flip, flip, here we are. Please don't mistake my intentions. I've often spent very late nights constructing for you, dear poem, before I must turn out the lights. No, poems, poems, flip page, God, where? Poems, poems, I don't understand. So I open the drawer back up and pull out my black pen. I flip the page and write over again. I have seldom comprehended the greatest love story of all time. The one from the big book, where you gave up your life, but I think that it must have something to do with loving one and seeing you flip. Yeah.